Many people think it's very convenient to buy baby food off the store shelves, but now I'm going to talk about the value of making your own food at home for your child. So first and foremost, it's actually much more cost effective to make your own food at home. It's on average about 45% less expensive per serving of food to make it at home than to buy it prepackaged in the store in a single serving. Also, you have the added benefit of the food being more nutrient dense. When you're buying a jar of shelf-stable baby food that's been sitting on the store shelves for two plus years, the FDA requires a certain amount of bacteria is eliminated from the food in order for it to be shelf-stable. But unfortunately, at the same time, the beneficial vitamins and minerals are also eliminated. So you end up with empty calories and about 5% of the nutritional benefit of the food. If you're cooking it lightly at home, then you're retaining close to 90% of the nutritional value of the food. Also, people don't realize how many added salts, sugars, chemicals, stabilizers are in prepackaged foods like these. You can definitely avoid those by making your own food at home. And you also can avoid BPA. A lot of people see glass baby food jars and they assume that it's more eco-friendly and safe as opposed to a regular can. But the truth is there is not a glass jar lid that is BPA free. So you would definitely be avoiding those risks by making your own food at home. Uh, last, you can also find value in making your own baby food at home by being able to tailor the texture of the food itself to your baby's preferences. Some babies are finicky about textures and flavors, and when you're making it by yourself at home, you can actually tailor it to your child's needs. So those are the top reasons why it's more valuable to make your own baby food at home.